and Sonic, Sonic. by Archie. Um, you yep. know, it's the same thing. And um, but yeah, so but you guys, so talk about like you guys had planned out this story arc, right? For Forever War. Yes. You want to? Well, we take it saw here, Forever War, how it didn't happen, but then how it, how uh, later down the road. Right. So the writing was, was on the wall, happen, and now it is happening. I think the writing was on the wall that yeah. um, that Turtles was gonna go, and we thought, okay, if it's gonna go, if it's gonna if they're going to pull the plug on us, let's go out, like, let's go out big. So, um, Murph plotted out, like, a five-issue wrap-up the whole series. And we were going to bring back all the, it was going to be, you know, like, the, the ye old um, time travel, dystopian, alternative timeline, Shredder wins, blah, blah, blah. You know, we've seen, we've, we've danced this dance before. Um, and, we we did the covers uh, based on on the descriptions, and um, I think he even solicited them because it's coming. And then I drew the we pencil inked and lettered the first issue, and then Archie said, "Now we're canceling the book." And um, Murph called and told me this. I love this story. Uh, Murph called and told me um, they're pulling the plug. They're willing to pay you for whatever you can finish by the end of the week. And I think I had penciled five pages. So I penciled the rest of that book in like four days. It looks like garbage. And I <laughs> and I still have uh, a bunch of those pages. I, I made copies and sent them to Murph. And it's like, Murph said, I don't care what they look like. Pencil the pages. Send it to me. They'll pay you for it. I'm like, okay, you know. <laughs> But that was it. That was that was the end of of, of the series and and the Forever years, War. That years, sounds like familiar. Yeah, kids would be um, the the kids who were reading it then um, got into college, and I, my emails would start pinging. And it's like you know, people hunted us down and were like, "Whatever happened with the with the Forever War? Are you guys going to finish it?" It's just, it was always this thing. It was like you would find it on. Um, lost media websites too it was like this holy grail for people and i would always say you know i'd love to do it but i'm not gonna do it by myself um i always wanted to do it with murph i always thought that that would be proper um and then i think idw started making noise or forgive me i don't know the, the yeah because at this story. point at this point in the story that they didn't just cancel that story that Chris and Murph were working on, but then they also just, like I said, they did some kind of weird other miniseries with other writers and artists, and then they pulled the plug all together. So it at that point, Archie didn't have Turtles anymore, and it had gone over to IDW, just so people know the chronology of when Chris right. mentions IDW. But at that point, IDW had the publishing rights to yeah. uh, the 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 more, you know, kid version of Turtles. It wasn't a miniseries. It was that um, Murph had uh, a couple standalone um, issues. Yeah. That, well, that, that came that, first. That had, right. And then Archie did some other series without you guys. And, and I, I remember it. I remember Not that I recall, but I... But I don't remember what it was. It, it was inconsequential, but... Yeah. Um, and then I think uh, there was some talk about let's, let's finish the... I think Murph told me that they were in talks to let's finally finish the Forever War when it was at IDW. I think it was for anniversary thing. Um, and then just when we were about to do that, the sale to Nickelodeon went through, and that stopped mm. everything. And then um, there's an ad and, for that too. Yeah, there's an ad you can find online for the IDW Forever War five issue series that never was. Yep. Yep. Yeah, it came. It came so close. Came so close. <laughs> Twice. I saw something the other day about like some TMNT. Like they did a whole. I, it was in essence another presentation about like the movies that they had made, and that Forever War sounds like what would have been the fourth movie. I that sounds so familiar. Like oh my like, god, that fourth movie they were developing. I think it like they tried it two or three times and they got close and they got called off. A number of times. I actually really like the quote unquote fourth TMNT CGI uh, one. The That's 2007? Yeah. 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 I actually went. 
I want you in, and that's a continuation the... of the other three because you'll notice yeah. that it, when it ends, they've got the time scepter from three and all <laughs> the, the the stuff from the earlier films are in there. I went to school with with the director's daughter. She sat right beside Andy Monroe. I don't know. Is, to me, it, is, it kind of felt like a cross between the Incredible Hulk CGI and Transformers. Like they made them like larger than life. Wait, are you talking about you talking no, no, about that's the Michael, new? I'm talking. Yeah, that's the, the Michael Bay made, one. Oh, okay. right. No, we're talking, talking about, about the 07. Oh, okay. yeah, in 07. It, it was yeah. A, yeah. a cartoon on Nickelodeon. No, it came no. out in theaters. No, 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 yeah, no, 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 no. Oh, I know what you're yeah. talking about. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm sorry. Where oh, Leo yeah, comes right, back yeah. from, like, feature, yeah, right Leo now. comes back from his his vision quest or something, and then he and he Raph and Raph have that fight. Has like on armor the, and yeah. yeah, I like that one. That one's good. That one felt like that the, the, the old bad. one. Yeah, but didn't Patrick Stewart voice the villain in that? Pretty sure. Anyway, like I said, we could talk for old movies like yeah, I might have much to, more I might have to watch that for five one, hours. Yeah. Anything else? <laughs> <laughs> Hey, Mike, okay. I found Arbiter that. Arbiter Down and TMNT 2007. That's what you're doing tonight. You're not getting any sleep. <laughs> um, By the oh, way, we're... the story about the Forever War. So they Nickelodeon and then pulled the plug. So um, there was no Turtles, as far as I'm concerned, you know, uh, for years. And then um, I got contacted by a gentleman in Russia named Arseny Dubikov. And he uh, somehow, I don't know, um, had the rights to d- be reprinting the old uh, uh, TMT Adventures books in the Soviet Union, uh, in the former Soviet Union, sorry, Russia, and wanted to know if I wanted to do new covers. And um, I'm like, you know, hell yeah, yeah, sure. Like, the rubles as good as dollars, I'll do it. And um, uh, again, He's a great guy. I got nothing bad to say about Arsini. I'm hoping that he's not been be, going to be drafted soon. Um, and again, talking to him, it's like, uh, whatever happened with the Forever War? And I'm like, dude, I, I, I can't tell you. I don't think, I think it's dead now. He said. So what he decided he wanted to do was crowdfund and create the unauthorized five issue series. And what he wants to do then is once it's finished, he wants to say to go to the American publishers and say, look, it's, it's done. done now. Will you please publish it? It's right here. And I'm like, uh-huh. yeah, let's do it. So over the um, uh, over the past way too long, um, I've been doing that in my spare time. And I just finished my portion of it. Um, Arsini is, uh, uh, I think, Andrew Modine. Um, who also worked on the the turtles back in the day um uh did the script for it we got murph's blessing murph didn't want to be involved in the project um i gotta say in a, in a way that i'm not entirely clear on the details of murph has some residual bitterness towards the way his relationship uh ended with the turtles so he didn't really want to be a part of it um, but he said, I'm sure you guys will do a fine job, you know, you know, Godspeed. And I'm like, okay, wow. yeah, sucks, but so- oh well. Um, and, uh, yeah, so I just finished it and, um, hopefully in the next few months, um, that's an odd frog, uh, podcast preview. exclusive, exclusive. <laughs> <laughs> that's right. So Jeff you can Jennifer. you can you can get your copy if you go to um, Chris Allen Doodles uh, dot com. I have uh, a page there that has links to uh, where you can um, uh, order just, it off of. Our, we'll put a link to your website in our show notes as well. Oh crap! I guess I better update it <laughs> and make sure that it's not all full of broken links. 